Hey everybody, welcome back to Poetic Fitness. Today, we've got a body weight hit. We're gonna be high plank, low plank, all over the place, using every bit of our body. Uh, we have a 50-10 tempo, no reason to delay. The question to think about today is, what's your favorite board game? I'm gonna get ready to click this button, and as we do, we'll start in five seconds. First movement, just so you know it, is a cross jack, half cross jack. So normally we cross, and the legs are alternating. Today, you're gonna keep one out front, one behind, and you're gonna be doing a half cross jack. So you'll keep this leg out front, and that's gonna throw your balance off. Then we'll hit the other side, clicking that button. You know the first move, you've seen it, so you've got five seconds to think about it. Here we go. Play button, boom. Five seconds, first move, half cross jack. Get that right foot forward, and we're jumping. So you're just hopping like this. Modifier, I would say you just step that front foot over and back. You're gonna put a lot of balance on the back leg, but what that's gonna do, it's gonna make your body have to challenge itself, stabilize itself. 50-10 tempo today. So this should be challenging. You just keep pushing your way through. This first move is going to get the heart rate going and set the tempo for the rest of the workout. Yeah, buddy, here we go. What's your favorite board game? Think about it. You got lots of choices. Two, one. All right, shake it out. Catch your breath, big deep breath through the nose. Out the mouth. Right foot or left foot's forward now. And we are cross jacking. Let me give you a little angle here just so you can see it all. Again, it's awkward. You just gotta get your, your balance. It's gonna feel weird because we're not alternating. So it's put everything on that one side. Push, push, push through. Work hard. We are here to get fit. So let's do it. Let's do it. Calf muscle could be about to explode. That's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. Another modifier would just be control it. And you just go nice and slow. Break. All right, next move for all the push-ups. So we are starting in a plank. And what we're doing is we are gonna go back with our butt low, our knees close to the ground, and then we come forward. Do a push up. Get all the you can, so keep the knees low and go back. It's like you're doing a squat. Don't put your butt up high. It's like you're kind of trying to sit on your heels. Like a frog, and then a push up. If the push up's too much, don't do it. If the plank is too much, as you go back, put the knees down. And then come forward and do a knees push up. So you can easily keep the knees on the ground and still get this motion. That way you can build the strength needed to put the feet down and then get the full movement. Modifiers should never be looked at as not as good as the other ones because your break, you're gonna be better at certain moves than you are at others. And until you develop strength for certain moves, you gotta challenge yourself. Pogo pirate on the right. So we're standing on one foot. We go toe touch, hop, other hand toe touch, hop, hands on the ground, sprawl, back in, hop. So left, hop, right, hop, hands down, hop. Do not think of this as a move you need to get a million reps. Control it, control it. Once you feel comfortable and you feel like you're not bouncing all over the room, you could then speed the movement up. I'm gonna keep this pace so you can see it. Modifier, take the hop out, and when you do the plank, you could use two feet. Or you don't have to touch your toe, you can touch your knee or your shin, and you can take the sprawl out all together. Break, okay. Left leg, fix your tights. Favorite board game, huh? What do you like, Scrabble? 
We like Candyland. Clue. Toe. Hop. Toe. Hop. Plank. Sprawl, I should say. Again, pick something to look at. Don't rush the move. Use your core, get your balance. And stare at one thing. The more you lift your head up, the more you look around the room, the more you'll lose your balance. Whatever you do, don't close your eyes. <laughs> or you're gonna go down like a sack. Oh, potatoes. <sighs> Keep working. Keep working. And if you start to hop around the room a little more, that's fine. Just try to stay in control. If you end up going over here and turning, it's gonna burn. Break. All right. Now we're in a crab position. Hands can be however it's comfortable for you. Put, put your fingers sideways and it protects your wrists. And then we're going opposite hand to toe. So we're just alternating. Crab, toe touch. And this control, you want to kind of sink, raise up, sink, raise up, modifier. Sit on that butt. Alternate. Otherwise, you're up here. Working the triceps. Working it out. We're working it out. A lot of body weight control, but we're still going to get that heart rate going. 10 seconds left. We will be in the scorpion or plank position. Three, two, one. Okay. It's a very challenging move. You can do it on one foot, which would be the advanced movement, or you do two feet. So we're in a scorpion. We've got our right foot down on our tippy toes, and we're gonna bring that knee to the ground, lift it back up. Knee to the ground, lift it back up. Nice control, modifier here. Both feet down doing it, or you can stay on one foot, keep your knee on the floor, lift it, and then go back to the ground and rest between reps. Otherwise, full version, knee almost touches, and then that goes. We're basically in a scorpion, which is a down dog on one leg. Challenging the quad. If you notice when my knee comes down, I'm probably max two feet from my wrist. we got less than 10 seconds. Way to work, way to push, way to push, way to work. Two, one, goes the weasel because the weasel goes pop. We got the left leg because it's jealous. If you're modifying, keep it up. Here we go. On that left, you drop it, raise it. Ooh. And you can in between, you can straighten that leg behind you or you can just keep it bent for a little added weight. Yeah, everybody. I think I feel the sweat starting to come on. I feel the sweat starting to kick. 50 years old, I like to kick. Oh boy. I got that full version happening here. Don't forget to modify when needed, where needed, however needed. We got four, we got two, got a break. The next move is a triple lunge jump. So we're in a lunge. We get ready to start. We go one, two, lunge. One, two, other side lunge. So it's a hop, hop, then you lunge. Hop, hop, other side. If the triple lunge is too much, alternating forward lunges. Otherwise, one, two, lunge. One, two, other side. Try to focus on still keeping good form. Try not to land with this knee way out front. Keep the balance, keep the weight back. If this is hard on the knees, slow the movement down. Control your lunge. Get the movement. Control the lunge. Otherwise, you make, make it one solid movement. Here we go. Break. Great work, everyone. Last move of the first round. Low plank side steps. 
I'm gonna get right here and show you. Get nice and cozy, fingers clasped or hands down, and we're stepping out to the side. Step to the side, really step as far as you feel like you can go. Make that, those obliques work. Modifier, put the knees down, and you can step with the knees, or full version. We can go with different version. I'm gonna come over here a little closer to you guys over there. Coming over here to you guys over there. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. I'm just all over. Less than 10. Less than 10. Break. Great work, everyone. First round in the boats. Now we go to the second round. Ping. Cross jack, set your right foot out front. Catch your breath. Get your hop. Just get moving. Now you've seen everything. So these jumping moves, you can really get that heart rate back up. Because we want to get the heart rate going, get out of breath. That way when we do our plank moves and our muscles, strong muscles, we got to really work those muscles and we're out of breath. It's just a bonus, that's all. It's just a bonus. <gasps> I'm starting to get a little delirious, so we may just start saying things right now. Two of them, one. All right, catch your breath. Big deep breath, switch legs. Give you a little side view here. Way to work. Way to work. Let's keep it moving. Just so you're mentally prepared, the next move will be down in the plank. You got about 20 seconds. If you're feeling frisky, speed it up. If you're feeling a little wild hair, speed it up. Speed it up. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Right. Okay, here we go. You got your towel, keep it nearby. Frog push-ups. So we're in that plank. We go frog, push-up, boom. Frog, push-up. Let me give you a few different angles so you can see everything. Frog, push-up. And then once you've got it, Push up, frog. Push up, frog. Push up, yeah. Froggy, pushy, pushy, froggy. Froggy meat push ups. Push ups meet frogs. Whew. And when you speed that push up, let me tell you, that heart rate's gonna start to be like thunder. Boom, 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 boom. And then you go back into the pogo part and oh my god. Break. This is where it gets fun. This is where you gotta take a deep breath, dig deep, pogo pirates. Right foot, toe touch, hop, hop. There it is, there it is. I will set the pace. Feel free to go faster than me or slower than me. I'm just giving you a pace. I'm giving you a pace. Yep. That leg will start to burn. And what you want to do is fight. Fight like hell and dodge the burn. And if it does let it burn, you just say to yourself, it's not going to get any worse. It burns. Break. Get your towel. Let me. 
Touch it. Touch it. Yep. Yep. Sick. Yep. Keep pushing, keep working. Great job, everyone. If you've made it this far and you're still going, great work. Way to challenge yourself, way to push yourself. If you're doing modifiers, I'm proud of you. That means you're staying with it. And you're not giving up. Three, two, one. Oh boy. Grab, toe touch. So now, catch that breath. And get in that crab. We're alternating. I don't want you to just like do a real quick eight. Control. Control. That way you're stabilizing. You're using your muscles to control your body weight. Now, if you are going like this and you're having to be fast with it, that's fine. Try to challenge, try to slow it down. Now you can go fast as long as you're controlling and you know that with that speed in the moment you can say, pause. Whoa boy. Three, two, one. I got this because I love it. Okay guys, scorpion, knee drop. Hands down, right foot on the ground. Dropping that knee. Try to drop the knee right behind those hands. Now, if you're not that flexible and you have to be way out here, that's fine. Just make sure you got your butt in the air. You don't want to be out in this full plank doing a knee drop. The whole goal is to keep the weight in your hands and your butt in the air. Way to work. Way to work. Everybody. I don't know why I started singing. I apologize. Two, one. All right. Board games, huh? We like Battleship. You know? Seen it? What's the next move? Left leg. Sorry, everyone. Left leg, two moves left after this. Two moves left. Make sure you keep breathing at this point. Way to work, way to go. We just gonna push. Good job. We've got 10 seconds left on this move. Shoulders are burning. Okay, what do we got? Two, one, break. We got two moves left. So we are getting to the end of this workout, everybody. Way to work. Dig deep, stick with me. Triple lunge hops, right leg out. Remember, we go hop, hop, lunge. Hop, hop, other side. Keep fighting. Dig deep. Stay with it. Twenty seconds. You guys are doing great. Good form, I see you there. I see you sweating and working hard. Okay, I can't really see you. Break. Last move. Fill those lungs up. Fill those lungs up. Low plank steps, here we go. 
Low plank steps. Low plank steps. Oh, boy. This is real sweat coming out of me. It's not a bottle of fake sweat. So everybody, be proud if you're still here. Be proud if you're still fighting. Be proud if you're still working. The point I'm trying to make is be proud. We're all here for a reason. Just remember why, what that reason is, what your goals are. And in five seconds, we're holding the low plank. Break. Now the timer's not going, but I'm gonna count down. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Break. Oh. Well, that was fun. If you got a towel, snag it. Dry it off. No reason to hang out. You guys are probably ready to get on to your next workout or get on with the rest of your day. So, I'll tell you, my favorite board game, Scrabble, love it. My son's really good at it. He might be the best at it. All challengers welcome. Anyways, what's your favorite game? Let me know. Thanks for being here. Hope you enjoyed this workout. See you guys next time.